The memorial is located in Wood County, in front of the Wood County Courthouse in Wisconsin Rapids. It all began as Jack Cahoon's effort to get diplomas for high school classmates who had served in World War II. It grew into something bigger. We decided that, to, that we ought to be recognizing more than just these classmates. Why not in Wood County recognize all veterans of World War II? You know, this is how things grow. And we decided that we would do something. And in fact, we did dedicate a bronze plaque that's in, in Veterans Park, downtown Wisconsin Rapids, that's, a, that's a, a tribute to veterans of World War II. We had a little money left over from this, a couple thousand dollars. And that's when we thought, why don't we do something in front of the courthouse? Why don't we recognize all veterans from Wood County who died in service as a result of war? When we finally finished, we had over 400 names on our memorial. And we also decided to have the memorial built in the shape of Wood County. That's why you see the shape that it is. Now this memorial is not just for those who died, but it's a tribute to those veterans and their families. Jack appreciates the Memorial Committee's valuable work on the project and its ongoing success. I've got to say also that I have never been involved in a more hardworking and active committee than we've had with this thing. These people, if they come up with an idea and we'll get it done, and they have gotten it done. Area students got involved by researching and writing stories about many of the veterans listed on the wall. You'll find these stories on the memorial's website. Along the way, we have established a website. We've got over 150 stories on our website. And the website is woodcountyveteransmemorial.org. This memorial united the entire county, bringing together organizations, businesses, schools, families, and individuals to honor those who gave the greatest sacrifice. I see people um, having a strong feeling of being included. It's a, a spirit thing, I think. The generosity of this community is just overwhelming to us that have been involved in this because people came together to make this happen over and over and over. And the Community Foundation has been with us every step of the way.